Plus of Beauty. I'm so excited to get the day started and see what today is all about beauty event. <laughs>
top level and I'm about to get shape matched in the Dior Backstage Foundation. I'm going to show you guys a little bit as to what everything looks like. It is so beautiful, so aesthetically pleasing. Let me show you guys.
up today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Today's event was super fun. Some of my favorite brands were definitely probably Tatcha as well as Glow Recipe. Uh, they also gave us this little goodie bag once we left today. So definitely gonna unbox this once I get to the house or even in the car. Make sure that you guys are liking today's video. Also subscribing to my YouTube channel. Enjoy the rest of your day wherever you're at and I'll see you guys in my next video. Okay, so quickly, I also just wanted to go over with you guys everything that was either gifted to me in uh, the goodie bag. This entire goodie bag is filled with stuff. We're definitely going, gonna go into that and then also Okay, so we're just going to start off by unboxing this one here. This, I purchased a ticket for $99, and this is the goodie bag that was gifted to me once I exited the event. So let's go ahead and unbox everything that's in here. Um, so first is by Laneige, and this is a lip sleeping mask. Looks like this, and it actually looks like a pretty good sized bottle as well. And, oh, nice. This is what it looks like. And it is a lip, lip sleeping mask, which I love to moisturize my lips before I go to sleep as well as in the morning. So I will definitely be using this. Love that. And again, um, you know, so far I'm pretty pleased. It is a good size package. And oh look, it even comes with a little lip brush that says Laneige on it. I don't know if you guys can see that. So that's really cute. Uh, let's see here. Next we have Unseen Sunscreen SPF 40 by Supergoop. So cool. Um, let's see what the packaging looks like. Okay, looks like this. Not bad. That's a good size bottle as well. Let's see, we have Cheeky Stamp Blendable Blush in Kaja. Or I'm sorry, embossy. Oh, these are really cute. What is this? Remove film before using. Okay. So it's a stamp. Interesting. I don't know if I would ever use that. All the girls at the Essentia booth, you guys rocked it. You guys were all so beautiful, so really good job. Enjoyed this. All right, a few more items. Uh, next, there are some Would I Lie Velour Lashes. Looks like so. <laughs> Will you stop staring? <laughs> okay, so. These are cute. I obviously get my lashes done, so I would not be wearing these. Um, if you guys want these, just leave a comment down below and I will send them to you. So, yes. Next, we have by Fenty Beauty. I'm really excited for this. I don't have any Fenty Beauty products whatsoever. And this shade is called Shouty. Shouty. Guys, it's been a long day. I've been up since 4.30, so... Please excuse me if I look a little tired. Um, I am, and I'm still going to meal prep after this. So, oh, this is adorable packaging. It's actually kind of light. So let's see what this looks like. Okay, shouty. Shouty looks beautiful. Oh, that is a beautiful, like, brick brown deep color. I really actually love that beautiful oh the fb that's embossed damn that's nice all right so i'm loving this one very very cute again so if you guys purchased the ticket for a hundred dollars i received the laneige lip sleepy mask some sunscreen the fenty beauty shoddy matte lipstick um the cheeky stamp the Briogeo sample of the shampoo and also the lashes. So honestly, I think that is excellent for a ticket of $99. Um, they're all full size products and I would purchase that ticket again. Hey guys, sorry if there's any like background noise, just ignore it, okay? Next we're gonna go over 
Um, so once you walked into the event today, um, they all handed us uh, these empty Sephora bags and we got to fill them up with a bunch of different samples, products, things that you purchased. So that was nice. Let's just start off with this beautiful rose that Fresh Beauty passed out to everyone. Uh, I really wish that Fresh Beauty uh, was selling their rose toner. Um, because that is a really good toner you guys and I thought it would I would have purchased it if they had it at their booth but they didn't I thought this was a very generous gift it actually made my day when she gifted it to me at the very end um, she was very sweet so thank you so much I really love this rose it smells so good too by the way vital proteins you guys know is um, a brand I really really love Cabinet. Let me go to my cabinet really quick so I can show you guys the vital proteins that I take every single day. I'll show you guys really quick. Okay, so these are the vital proteins that I take every single day. One is just my collagen peptides and then sometimes when I want a little bit of caffeine or a different type of taste, I will drink my matcha. So I love my collagen peptides. I recommend collagen peptides really to everyone I know. But yeah, that's just something I drink every day to keep my skin hydrated. Vital Proteins gave me a sample of the matcha collagen peach, which I'm really looking forward to trying that one. And then also we have strawberry lemon, beauty collagen peptides, and then just the regular unflavored one, which again, I do have a canister of. So I love this brand. I really recommend you guys um, trying it out. It's really good. I notice a huge difference in my skin when I am taking collagen water versus when I'm not. So um, I do recommend it. And let's move on to the next one. La Mer was stellar. Their, their little showroom was this giant cream. Just imagine walking into a giant Cream, literally I got a sample of I think born this way foundation I also did order a foundation when I was there um, they didn't have it in stock um, they didn't I don't think carried any foundations in stock they had this beautiful just aisle of all the foundation shades from like light to dark dark to light every shade in between it was beautiful aesthetically very pleasing but because there were so many shades I don't think they carried any in stock. So I did order the new uh, Dior Backstage Foundation in my shade, and I'm excited to try that out. She also gave me a sample of it, that's right. So I got a sample of Born This Way, and then I got a sample of the foundation that I did order, which is the, again, Dior Backstage. All right, next, uh, Urban Decay. Urban Decay's booth was actually pretty live. The girls there were full of energy, uh, full of compliments. I really enjoyed myself when I went to that booth and they provided this makeup bag, um, which I would probably gift to my mom. She loves little makeup bags like this. And then they also gave out a bunch of um, these naked pins. They had like little cherries on them. That's like the theme of their palettes right now is cherries. It Cosmetics they provided a sam sample of their secret sauce moisturizer. I can't wait to try this. This looks really good. Look at that packaging. Um, again, Urban Decay, they gave out so many of these. I, I'm not sure if these are stickers or tattoos. I don't know. Gucci, Gucci. I'm going to try to um, pull up a photo really quick. Gucci was one of my highlights of today's event. Their little booth area was very cute. They had tea time. I loved it. Um, so love Gucci pens at the moment. This brand I'm loving, it's called Glow Recipe, and they're known for their watermelon sleeping glow mask. I absolutely love this mask, you guys. Um, Paris, you're the one who actually put me on this mask and gifted it to me for Christmas. So again, thank you, thank you, because I absolutely really do love this mask. This is my third bottle. And oh, it looks like they upgraded their spatula. They had a small, um, a small one before. And you guys, just look at the packaging. I just love detail, and this is really good packaging. And let alone this in my bathroom, I love this. Can't wait to use this before I go to sleep. Um, basically, I, I wear it right before I go to sleep when I wake up. It's a light, exfoli exfoli a light exfoliant 
um, removes all the dead skin or texture on my face when I wake up. You just simply like take a makeup wipe to your face, clean it off, and then my skin is not only very, very hydrated, but it also looks really, really glowy. So again, just like the name, Watermelon Sleeping Glow Mask, because it really does glow your skin. Next, I just got a sample of the Method Method Body Coconut Rice Milk Shea Butter Simply Nourish Body Wash. Uh, glow Recipe also provided these cute little samples of the Watermelon Glow Mask. So if somebody does want those lashes, I will stick one of these in the lash set that I will mail off as well. Next, there's just a lot of samples of like a Dior mascara sample. I'm excited to try this. Um, Tom Ford. Tom Ford had a really, really cute booth. Um, I felt like it should have been a little bit bigger, something else besides just uh, maybe the flowers. Um, love this. So Becca Cosmetics was very generous enough to provide me with two of the Shimmering Perfector Liquid Illuminators um, in Opal. So I'm excited to try this. It was really nice to meet the owner as well. Um, very sweet. We chatted for a minute. I told her that the Becca and Chrissy Teigen palette collaboration, as you guys know, is one of my favorite collabs and my favorite palettes. I use that all the time. This is by Tatcha. Uh, Tatcha had a really, really cute booth and they provided a pure one-step Camellia cleansing oil. I'm excited to try this. I really love their cleanser. This retails for around $90 a bottle, so I'm sure it's really good. I'm excited to try it tonight. Glam Glow gave um, Gravity Mud Mask as well as a Nude Glow. I've actually have had one of these samples before and I love this stuff. If you guys use um, MAC Strobe Cream in Peach Light, this is like very similar to that. It just gives a really, really, really good uh, glow and I like to either mix it in with my moisturizer or I'll mix it in with my foundation. So. Cute samples from Glam Glow. Uh, Belief Aqua Balm Sleeping Mask. Some hydrating products. Um, next is just some samples by Victor Rolf Magic. So those are all of the items that I was able to gather from today's event. Um, overall, I really, really enjoyed myself. It was like an experience going through each room. Some of the brands that I do wish were there were um, Way, Jen Atkins, where was your booth? I would have loved to purchase some wave spray, some volume spray, um, some rose body oil. Would have loved to see that brand there. I would have loved to see also Sol de Janeiro. Sol de Janeiro is my favorite. I was actually looking for that brand. I wanted to get the Bum Bum Cream. That would have been really cute. Um, some brands that really, really stood out to me today were the Glow Recipe. Their booth was so cute. And again, you guys, I love that. I love that Sleeping Glow Mask. Um, so Fenty Beauty had a really dope set. You were able to actually sit in like a flower. I think it was called Flower Bomb and lift up some confetti and it was magical. And I will show you guys a video here. That wraps up this entire video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Sephora, I think you guys did a phenomenal job for the most part, being that this is the first year of Sephora. I'm definitely looking to next year. Um, I'll definitely be going. I'll definitely be investing probably to in a higher level of ticket just to see kind of what that's about. All right, you guys, so that is it. I will see you guys on my next video, and thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.